everybody, it's Matt again from Matt's Music Academy. We've got the Gretsch out. I want to show you a rockabilly type lick uh, in the style of Brian Setzer. So I'm going to show you the lick, kind of show you the, the feel you can use it in, and then we'll break the lick down. All right, so it goes something like this. <laughs> So that's the lick. Now let's break it down. But listen, before we do, if this is your first time, please do me a favor and subscribe to my channel. Uh, ring the bell so you know when we have new videos coming out. Leave a comment. Give us a thumbs up if you like the video. It really helps us out. It really helps the algorithm of the channel. Uh, and I'd really appreciate it. Okay? So, uh, and real quick, <laughs> get it out of the way. If you're looking to play guitar or looking to play piano or something like that, Check out the links below uh, and check out what the Academy has to offer. Okay, so here's this Brian Setzer lick. I'm going to show you out of the key of G. You can play it anywhere. All right, there's not really any open strings, but here's how it goes. We're playing out of this G position, so it's going to start on this classic. So ring finger, or I'm sorry, middle finger, fifth fret B string, ring finger, uh, on the little E, sixth fret. I hit it twice, double stop it. Then we go down to this G position right here. All right, that G position. Uh, the B and E string on the third fret. All right, and then we're going to hold that, and then we're going to go down. We're going to hold the E note with our ring finger. And we're just going to go down to the second fret on the B string. So, uh, it sound, may sound familiar, it's kind of the claw, you know, so it's that claw lick. Uh, all right, so from there, we're going back to this, to a, more of a C position, but it's the G with our ring finger, fifth fret. We're going to cover up that, double stop that B and G string. And then we're down two frets. And hammering on uh, that uh, G string, fourth fret. Kind of like the old Merle Haggard. So. Uh, no charge for mistakes. resolve it there right on the G string or you can go back up and catch that G that B and E string up here so let's see some of these are hard to do slow all right kind of that fit. Hope you like it. That's the lick. It's a Brian Satcher lick. Again, make sure you subscribe. Click the link below. Check us out for uh, more videos and more licks on different instruments. Uh, see you next time.